everybody welcome to my channel if you're new feel free to hit that notifications button and subscribe and if you're returning thank you for coming back and let's go ahead and get started as you can see I'm going to talk about you should never do this well, what I mean by that is you should never assume that your plans in life are going to be what God has planned for you all right let's go up in prayer and get started dear Heavenly Father we want to thank you so much for the amazing plans that you have for us because no matter what those plans are, they are always going to be the best plans ever, even if they're not always the same that we thought that we had for ourselves. And we thank you for that. In your precious name, amen. So as you can see, I'm going to talk about today that a lot of you that know me, or some of you that know me, have known that I thought or wanted to be working in the surgical field as a surgical tech for many years. Um, but over the last couple months, I've really, really been thinking hard and praying to God because it's been on my heart because as you know um, a lot of people know how much I love to help people and that I just I love being you know out there to show God's love I love you know getting his word out there and helping anywhere in any way that I can and so it's really been on my heart to um, again if it and only if it's God's plan to become a Christian counselor and eventually one day open up my own office and so I kept, you know, praying and, you know, asking God, you know, show me something, whether that was his plan or, you know, if it was crazy. Well, over the last couple months, I've been, like I said, keep praying. And a couple weeks ago, all within two weeks, I got an email notification saying that I was accepted into school. My first quarter fully paid to finish off. I only have three classes left to finish off for my AAS degree and to start for the counseling program and to go and get my uh, Christian counseling um, degree and I will be able to start that this week and not only that but the reason why I want to share that with you guys is because when we have something planned for ourselves it's not always going to be what we think it is or what we want it to be but it's what God has planned for you so whatever you're going through right now in life or whatever you think think your plan is don't always count on that being the same because when you have plans or goals set for yourself they're not always going to match what God has for you and so each day it's really important to continue to thank God continue to pray to God and continue to ask God you know is this what you have planned for me are these your plans because whether it's a week a year or 20 30 years from now you're gonna look back and you're gonna be like wow this is why I went through everything I went through because God's plans are amazing compared to what we have and looking back now I am you know I can see why you know all the trials I've gone through and of course we're gonna have trials you know all throughout our life but looking back you know I am so thankful that you know God's opened up the doors for me to be able to go back to school and take the time off that I did because if I didn't have that time to take off from school I would have not you know as it says you know had that time to be able to see that God's plans were different you know to become a Christian counselor than working in a different field so again what I want you guys to get out of this video is that know that your plans are not always going to be what God wants and you may not always see that right away but know that God is always going to be there with you each and every step of the way you just have to be willing to have faith in him trust in him and just continue to move forward and keep that faith and know that he will always be there by your side each and every day and know that he will always always be there with you so again if you're new feel free to hit that notifications button subscribe and know that he's always there for you and again know that you're loved by him all right so let's go and close out in prayer and stay tuned for my next video and know that you are loved by jesus all right, dear Heavenly Father, we just want to thank you so much again for always being there for us. And I just lift up anybody that needs prayer or that may be, you know, questioning what you want them to do as far as careers, jobs, you know, if they're making the right choices or whatever it is, let them know that they are loved by you and that you will walk through them each and every step of the way. They just need to continue to follow your path, live the way that you want them to live and continue to encourage them to walk your path, Father God, not their own, but yours. And we thank you for that. In your precious name, amen. All right, again, thank you all for watching this video. And again, know that you are loved by Jesus. All right, love you all and have an amazing day.